Here are five ideas to earn online from painting. At the end, I will tell you the procedure to get such income ideas for yourself. Check if you are able to answer the short question in the pinned comment after watching. Do you think your friends whom you share this video can surpass your score? 1. Sell paintings on online art marketplaces. Step 1. Create a collection of artwork. Start by creating a collection of your paintings. Ensure they are photographed or scanned in high resolution to showcase their details. Step 2. Join online art marketplaces. Sign up on popular online art marketplaces like Etsy, Saatchi Art, or Artfinder. These platforms specialize in selling art. Step 3. Set up your shop. Customize your shop profile, add a bio, and write engaging descriptions for your artwork. Include pricing, dimensions, and shipping information. Step 4. List your paintings. Create individual listings for each painting. Include high-quality images from various angles, details about the inspiration, and any special framing options. Step 5. Promote your shop. Share your art shop on social media platforms, art forums, and through email newsletters. Engage with your audience and respond to inquiries promptly. Step 6. Fulfill orders. When a painting is sold, carefully package it to ensure it arrives in perfect condition. Consider offering options for custom commissions as well. 2. Create art prints and merchandise. Step 1. Choose artworks to reproduce. Select a few of your popular or visually striking paintings that can be reproduced as art prints and on merchandise like posters, mugs, or t-shirts. Step 2. Find a printing partner. Research and collaborate with a reliable printing partner that offers high-quality art prints and custom merchandise production. Some options include Printful, Printify, or a local print shop. Step 3. Design your merchandise. Create digital versions of your artwork that are suitable for printing on various products. Ensure the artwork meets the printing partner's specifications. Step 4. Set up an e-commerce website. Create a website using platforms like Shopify, WordPress with WooCommerce, or BigCommerce. Customize your site to showcase your artwork and merchandise. Step 5. List products and set prices. Add your art prints and merchandise to your e-commerce site, set prices, and provide detailed product descriptions. Step 6. Market your products. Use social media, email marketing, and online advertising to promote your art prints and merchandise. Offer special promotions or bundles to attract customers. 3. Teach online painting classes. Step 1. Define your niche. Identify your painting niche or style, whether it's watercolors, acrylics, oil painting, or specific subject matter like landscapes or portraits. Step 2. Plan your courses. Outline your painting courses, including lesson plans, video content, and resources. Determine the skill level you'll cater to, such as beginners or advanced artists. Step 3. Choose an online course platform. Select an online courses platform like Udemy, Teachable, or Skillshare to host your courses. Create course outlines and set prices. Step 4. Create video lessons. Record high-quality video lessons demonstrating painting techniques, tips, and step-by-step -step tutorials. Edit the videos for clarity. Step 5. Publish and promote your courses. Upload your course materials, set up payment options, and publish your courses on the chosen platform. Promote your courses on social media, art forums, and through email marketing. Step 6. Engage with students. Actively engage with your students by answering questions, providing feedback on their artwork, and fostering a supportive online community. Sorry for interrupting. The remaining part of the video will play after this short break. These are all the places you can find me. 
Facebook, LinkedIn, Tumblr, Twitter, Pinterest, etc. I post videos on YouTube. I share trendy and popular curated content on Tumblr. You will find all the URLs in the description of this video. Let's now continue with the video. 4. Host virtual art exhibitions and auctions. Step 1. Curate artworks. Select a collection of your best and most unique paintings for a virtual art exhibition. Step 2. Create a website or use art platforms. Either create a dedicated website for your virtual exhibition or use art platforms like Artsy or Artsteps, which offer virtual gallery spaces. Step 3. Build an online audience. Promote your virtual exhibition through social media, email newsletters, and art-related forums. Consider collaborating with other artists for a broader reach. Step 4. Launch the virtual exhibition. Host a launch event for your virtual exhibition, inviting art enthusiasts and collectors to explore your artwork. Step 5. Enable online bidding. If you're open to selling your artwork through auctions, enable online bidding on your website or through an auction platform like eBay or Live Auctioneers. Step 6. Engage with attendees. Interact with attendees during the virtual exhibition, answer questions, and provide insights into your artistic process. 5. Art Subscription Boxes Step 1. Define your art subscription concept. Decide what you want to offer in your art subscription boxes. It could include exclusive prints, original mini paintings, art supplies, or a combination of these. Step 2. Source supplies and artwork. Procure the necessary art supplies and create exclusive artwork or prints that you'll include in each subscription box. Step 3. Set up an e-commerce platform. Create an e-commerce website to showcase your subscription box offering. Use platforms like Shopify or CrateJoy designed for subscription services. Step 4. Set subscription pricing and plans. Determine the pricing for your subscription boxes and create different subscription plans, e.g., monthly, quarterly, annually. Step 5. Market your subscription service. Promote your art subscription service through social media, art communities, and influencers. Highlight the exclusivity and value of your boxes. Step 6. Fulfill subscriptions. Ship out subscription boxes on the designated schedule. Provide excellent customer service and consider adding personal touches to each box.